Hello and welcome. It's currently 4am and I cannot sleep, so I thought I'll do a video. Papers, please. It seems like a nice chill game, so I can just blab over and tell some stories and shit. I'm armed with a trusty cup of tea. I have a milky with two sugars, if, I, if anyone was wondering. I tried coffee once and I found it too bitter. No matter why I had to, I just can't drink coffee. Um... If this is too quiet, or I just ramble, then I most probably won't post it. <laughs> but who knows? So, what story should I tell? Should I tell the story of when I got drunk and fell down some stairs and had sex with a random person? Or should I tell the story of when I got drunk and fell up some stairs and had sex with a random person? <laughs> About the first time I ate caviar, like the champagne show socialist that I am, <laughs> eating caviar. Before I tell that story though, I need to tell another story. Um, I was in a nightclub and getting drunk. I was dancing with some lesbians. And the head lesbian wanted to move to another club. And uh, I seemed to have joined onto their group. And so I followed them to the next club sort of thing. En route to the next club, we passed this like little alleyway where a random woman asked if I had a light. Uh, this woman turned out to be a prostitute. Uh, her prostitute name was White Chocolate, she was a large white woman, hence the name. And we started talking, small talk, which was weird. I asked her about her job and if she enjoyed it, and she asked me if I was enjoying my night with the lesbians. I said I was having fun, but I was lying, and I think she knew. White Chocolate said, fuck this, and stabbed out a cigarette, and both me and White Chocolate went to the nearest nightclub. And she ordered two shots of tequila, and that's how the great friendship began. Uh, she told me her real name was Michelle. Uh, Michelle's partner turned up. Michelle's partner was a small Russian lady called Tara, but because of her accent it sounded like Tiara. So everyone called her princess. Uh, Tara was a prostitute too, but she dealt with the more extreme fetishes. Uh, white chocolate and princess also do combo deals, like two girl for the price of one sort of thing. Uh, they told me that they would have sex for tricks, uh, and they would just pay to watch. Uh, Tara wasn't just small though, she was she was thin and she suffered from anorexia. Uh, from the outside they looked like a very weird couple, uh, but they held hand and kissed often. Michelle gave me her number a couple of shot later and uh, near punch up, Michelle gave me her real number. On the taxi ride home, I asked her about the two phone numbers thing. She told me that you can never be too careful. I said, how did you know I could be trusted? And she said, it was the way I drink. We both laughed. I still don't know why we laughed. Myself, Michelle and Tara would go nightclubbing most nights and they would share the stories of the weird tricks that they had at their day whilst I told shit jokes and got drunk. Uh, Michelle told me that one trick she had uh, th this trick would just lay on the bed and he wanted her to stand over him and then squirt squirty cream over his body and then Tara told me a trick about uh, how this person liked to be financially dominated which was really weird but I think the weirdest one was uh, they both told me that this guy ordered them to like stand naked in his room whilst he just sat in a chair and watched them nothing sexual it was uh just like naked statues. <laughs> One night, I got a phone call from Michelle and she got invited to a house party by one of her regulars. It wasn't really a house party, it was more like a penthouse party. I said yes and Michelle and Tara arrived in a private car to come pick me up and take me to this penthouse. I asked who the host was and they said Billionaire Bill. Now Billionaire Bill <laughs> was not a billionaire nor was his name Bill, but it was a nickname that stuck from his school days. At the, at the penthouse it was it was wall to wall Sodom and Gomorrah. Like there was naked ladies dancing on glass tables, there was couples sharing each other, I suppose swingers I think they're called. Uh, in the bathroom a homosexual orgy was almost breaking out. 
I remember I grabbed a beer and just chilled on the sofa and the penthouse was like a studio penthouse. So everything was open plan and it had like a really amazing uh, 360 like window thing going all the way around so you could see the beautiful sea of lights below like a shimming mirage almost. I'm rambling. <laughs> I drank and people talked to me and they told me of big deals like selling their private yachts for half a million or they talked about their third wives and how they were bleeding them dry with their constant plastic surgery. I just smiled and nodded and nobody was the wiser. I finally got to meet Billionaire Bill. Billionaire Bill was a dumpy balding man who wore a suit that was two sizes too small. He boasted about his tanned broke shoes costing him £500 and how the suit he was wearing was an Armani suit and uh, nobody could spill champagne on him. He handed me a bottle of Dom Parion and asked me where Princess was. I pointed vaguely in a direction and just drank straight from the bottle, like the classy man I am. I awoke the next morning, still sat on the sofa, and what was left of the champagne was now spilt on the sofa next to me. I looked up to see white chocolate and princess in the 69 position, on the floor beyond the glass table which I was resting my feet on, and that's when I saw the bowl of caviar on the glass table. And so I had a spoonful, and it was greasy, and made me feel sick almost immediately. It's funny because Princess looked up and said that she was hungry too, so we left. <laughs> Michelle raided the fridge for uh, two more bottles of white wine, and we just left. And that's the story of when I ate caviar. So, um, like I said, I'm really not sure if I'm going to actually post this or not. I just felt like I was just rambling. <laughs> but yeah, that's the story of when I ate caviar. <laughs>